Hey guys, and welcome back to Economics and Comics. I wanted to do some new videos just called Dollar Pickups. So every book that I, I think I did one before, but every book in these videos I picked up for a dollar, whether they're only worth a dollar or worth more, I'll tell you. Uh, but just kind of depending on, uh, you know, if there's keys or whatever, I basically just pick them up if there's a key or if it's a cool cub or something like that. So I picked up 11 books, so that's $11. And uh, I just wanna go through them with you real quick. So this is um, Spectacular Spider-Man, number 81. It's just a classic Cloak and Dagger cover. It's probably only worth a dollar, but Cloak and Dagger is so hot right now and the cover's nice that uh, I thought I'd buy it. That was just kind of the extra dollar I threw away. <laughs> so next up we have uh, Peter Parker Spectacular Spider-Man Annual number four. It's a really cool cover and it's the origin of Ben Parker. So that's probably a $2 book. Then I got the Uncanny X-Men number 300. That's a real clean book. It's the first appearance of the legacy virus. And I was looking online and one sold for 15 bucks. I was kind of surprised. So uh, that's a score for a dollar. So uh, this one is uh, Daredevil 2. 229. It's the uh, first appearance of Maggie Murdoch. That's probably sell uh, three to four bucks. And I mean, that's without shipping, so whatever, four bucks. Another classic Daredevil's first appearance in Nuke. These are selling for about ten bucks. Not a lot of money, guys, but I mean, that's this is the video dollar pickups. I mean, if I get a super score, then you'll see it. <laughs> um, this one here, um, I got lucky, I found a, these are kind of like VG kind of beater reader copies, but these, this is the whole Demon in the Bottle Iron Man series. You know the classic Iron Man cover where he's like drunk on the cover? Well, I didn't get that one, it was a little bit more, but I found these in a do dollar bin right next to him. So, this is part one of the Demon in the Bottle and it's the first appearance of Justin Hammer. So, you know, it's a five dollar book. Then we got number 121, it's part two of The Demon in the Bottle, another five dollar book. Uh, number 122 is part three of The Demon in the Bottle run. And the uh, origin of uh, Tony Stark, five bucks. 125, this is a more key, it's part six of The Demon in the Bottle, it's a third appearance of uh, Ant-Man, Scotty Lang. So this is kind of a sought after book. Um, I don't know, maybe five, 10 bucks. Let's just say five for this video. Uh, then we have number 126. This is uh, part seven of The Demon in the Bottle and I think it's an old uh, classic cover. I like the cover. And last we have number 127 which is the conclusion of The Demon in the Bottle, I believe part eight. And uh, that's about two bucks. So, you know, I spent $11 and after totaling it up, it's worth about 60 bucks. So, hey, whatever. If I could move them, I will. I might just throw them in like a little, little key box, you know, um, put them away and whatever. But, it, you know, it, and I, you know, part time I work at a comic shop with my buddy. I do real estate, but. I always see these guys coming in. This is a, I didn't get these at, at our store, but I always see these guys coming in the dollar bins and they're in there for hours picking. So I have a little secret spot I go to sometimes and I look around when they fill it up and pull out some stuff. But, uh, so there you go. 11 bucks, probably about 60 bucks worth of stuff. Range of uh, conditions. Uh, but I just want to do a quick uh, video called Dollar Pickup. So there you go. That'll be this one. I'll bring another one next time. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. All right. Bye-bye.